This is the most disorganised video I've ever filmed. Get off, get off the table. Get off the table. Dexter, get down. Get down. Oh, right. Where's the remote control? Bear, sit. <laughs> <laughs> sit down. Dexter, sit. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome to my pets video where I talk about my pets. <laughs> Lots of you are always very interested in my pets and um, I'm not in my office yet so I thought what better way to prolong the amount of videos that I film and don't have to finish my office than filming one downstairs with my pets. So yeah, this is a meet my pets video. This is Mr Bear and he is a British short hair cat. You might have seen British short hairs before, they're normally, um, they're not normally blue but you can get like grey blue ones. Can you get out of the camera, please? Uh, but Mr Bear is a gold pointed cream or something. And he is four and a half. Aren't you Mr Bear? What else would people like to know about Mr Bear? He's a house cat. He's never been out just because we used to live in East London and um, we had a flat. And so this is just going to be the most awkward video. Literally just the cat <laughs> sat in front of my head. So he never used to go out and then when we moved here he just didn't really seem to have very many life skills. So um, he just has the run of the house instead, don't you Mr Bear? Can you please turn around so people can at least see your face? Come here. So Mr Bear is five in October and I have had him for four years. Yeah, no, I've had him four years and a bit because I got him when he was about three months old, which I think is the norm. Anyway, because Mr. Bear is refusing to play ball with this, I'm going to cut in some pictures of him. But he's a very soft and cuddly cat and loves being, doesn't really like being stroked, but he likes being picked up and carried around or just, you know, cuddled. But weirdly, he kind of climbs up to you so that you lift him up. Whereas a lot of cats, I don't think, like having their feet off the ground, but he really likes it. He's a very, very strange man, aren't you? I think that he is a bit bigger than a usual cat. I think he's about eight kilos. Quite a lot of people call him fat, but he's not fat. The vet said he's not fat at all. British short hairs are very, very chunky cats. Um, and especially if they're neutered, they get this weird bit of tummy thing apparently um, but he is large but he's not particularly large for a British short hair he's probably about what he should be for a British short hair I've seen them bigger than him <laughs> this is Dexter Ben <laughs> it's not your turn anymore this is Dexter the dog Hello Dexter! Dexter's a cockapoo, which is a cross between, um, I was going to say cockatoo <laughs> <then. laughs> It's a cross between a poodle and a cocker spaniel. And he's completely insane, but lovely. Ooh, we love you, don't we? He's always running into windows and washing lines, and he's just completely mad. But it's just the most friendly and lovely dog that you could ever wish for, aren't you? Hey? Now Dexter is not supposed to have the run of the house, but he's so cute that quite often we give in and he ends up sleeping on the end of the bed when he's not supposed to be. And he's just really part of the family and um, he gets away with a lot more than he should get away with, don't you? His favourite thing is running and catching balls. So you can throw a tennis ball for him and he will just run for hours and hours and hours and hours. Um, he got really ill when we first had him. I think we'd had him for just under a year and he punctured his esophagus with something, they don't know what, and nobody kind of spotted it when we took him to the vet, so they really didn't know what the matter with him was and he got more and more ill until he nearly died 
And then finally, they worked out what it was just in time and he has an operation. So we nearly lost him. Um, but he's fine. There! There! Come here! <laughs> Dexter has a bit of a problem with um, scavenging and eating things that he shouldn't eat. And I don't just mean other animals' poo, I'm talking like uh, toys, bits of brick, twigs, um, rubbish, bits of car tyre. I mean, anything that you can imagine, he will eat. So quite often he gets a bad stomach and, you know, he has to purge himself. And we really try now to keep a lookout and um, stop him from eating things that he shouldn't eat. Mr. Bear! <laughs> He's taking your limelight, isn't he? Now, weirdly, I'm pretty sure that the dog weighs less than the cat, or I think they weigh about the same amount. Um, you're not getting on the table. There you go. You pose. Would you like me to brush you? Mm -hmm. oh. So yeah, those are my pets. I've also got a fish, um, but I'm not going to show you the fish because he's really, really boring. He doesn't do anything, just kind of floats around. We've had the fish since 2008. Um, there were two fish, one of them unfortunately died, as fish are wont to do. And um, yeah, this one's pretty old now. Seems to be growing quite big as well. It's like, it's probably going to be the size of a carp by the time he um, pops his clogs. Dexter is three in August. And we've had him, so we would have had him three years in December. We got him... I think on December the 2nd or 3rd, um, 2014. You said 2014. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. <laughs> we got him in December 2013. Hurrah! We ran out of battery, didn't we, Dexter Dog? We ran out of battery, but we're back again. I was just saying to uh, Natalie, who sat beside me, is this going to be a really boring video? I feel like I'm just talking a load of rubbish about my pets. But Natalie was like, it's your pets, everybody loves them. So hopefully you're not too bored. If you don't like pets, then probably not the video for you. Um, but yeah, if you have any questions about them, then leave them below and I shall uh, answer them when I get a moment. That is Dexter and the bear. Mr. Bear, do you want to come and um, give a little final goodbye? Come on. Thing he doesn't want to do, basically. But that's pretty much all cats, isn't it? Mm. I think. Whereas Dexter, Dexter does this at all, don't you, Dex? Most of the time. No, the dream is not for you. You can have a chicken thing. Let's get a shot with both pets. 